Um, IR featured pretty heavily in question time today all around the issue of these labour hire firms. The government says uh, this is about uh, equal pay workers, one on a, let's say, a, an award agreement, one who's paid by a labour firm doing the same job, being paid fairly. The building sector, particularly miners too, they say, no, this is about taking workers away from labour hire firms and funnelling them through uh, union agreements and boosting union numbers. BHP's come out. They said this change will cost them $1.3 billion plus across their operations. Uh, a lot of concern from business. This is the first sort of chip we've seen in 12 months with the government where they're actually speaking out and there's talk of them running a fairly significant media campaign uh, where's this going in terms of politics, do you think, Andrew? Well, I just think it's it's going to have a lot more issues for the government than the multi-employer stuff. And, uh, I mean, I interviewed Tony Burke on Sunday Agenda and I actually just said to him, point blank, are you worried this could crash the economy? Because if you look at an industry like construction, it, the inflation in that industry is is way over... Uh, the inflation figure of 7%. You're looking at 20 to 30%. A lot of that is about shortage of labour. And, and, and that's, uh, that extra cost is, uh, that's built in uh, includes a lot of these construction firms using labour hire firms. So if you say to them you, ha the, you have to pay the labour hire workers more, that leads to even more inflation. So that's the risk. It's not the greatest time, frankly, mm. to do this. Now, the government keeps saying, look... Uh, if we raise wages, it's not going to inf affect inflation. That's just uh, pretty difficult to believe, frankly. So it has to be measured. It has to be careful if they're going to do this. Burke argues that he will do that. He's consulting. But there are massive dangers here in the government pursuing this. Now, Burke's argument is to, look, this was an election promise. We have to do it. OK, but, I mean, it, it, the economy is in a very precarious position. If you put a lot of costs in for yeah, business well, at the moment, watch the whole thing blow up potentially. Yep. That's my concern, I guess.